really busy here for breakfast here. Okay, so we just managed to uh, get some breakfast here. There's no breakfast at our hotel, so we just came back to the cafeteria where we were yesterday. Uh, one thing we noticed straight away is that uh, as soon as you're out of the the major city, then uh, nobody speaks English, not even the word water they understand. So we have to use a uh, Google Translate again, but uh, never mind, they're helpful and friendly. We managed to get some eggs and bread and uh, some tea, and so everything is okay. And now we're back on the bikes, we should be in the Vietnamese countryside again. We have to cross uh, three rivers today, and the first one will be the Mekon River, so that should be uh, Exciting to see what that looks like. So we'll be crossing it today, then cycling away from it, and then we'll be coming back to it in a few days. So, uh, so yeah, we'll uh, finish and, up here. Oh, and sorry. I think we need to uh, cross with the ferry two times today. Okay. I have looked on the map. Okay. okay. Yeah. Two times. So yeah, we'll get going now and see what the uh, the countryside looks like here again. Okay, first sight of the Mekon River over there. Crossing that in a few minutes. Okay, now we are crossing the Mekong. Pretty big bridge here. Video selfie chaos. Very good. Thank you. Okay, that was selfie madness. <laughs> We've never seen anything like that before. What do you think of that, Jamie? Very good and strange. <laughs> <laughs> never had so many selfies taken in one minute. So the first time we've seen electric bikes on this trip. Quite a lot of children riding around on electric bikes. Once again, Mapsmere has taken us on a wonderful route here. It's like cycling on the uh, cycling lanes in Denmark here. Apart from the fact that there's much more vegetation and banana trees around us. Approaching our second major river crossing today. Another electric scooter there. Okay, we finally found a place for lunch. <laughs> what do we have? What we found here? No, I mean you just go over to the kitchen there and you just 
point of what you want, so it seems to work. No English here at all. And their favourite pastime is karaoke, everywhere over here. How's this karaoke blasting out of them? Like the, well, but the whole village here is involved in uh, coconut production of some kind. There's coconuts everywhere. the back streets of Vietnam you see things like this. <laughs> Much better on these smaller roads than on the main roads. Okay, okay everybody I think the coconuts here are used to make rope because outside the coconut there are some hair and I think that is they're making rope out of it. Yeah, we're seeing uh, rolls of rope being driven past, so... See if we can find a guy with the rope to the final product. Yep, this is actually the road. <laughs> Okay, so once again we are about to cross the Mekon. Down at the end of the Mekon here, it splits into several branches. So this is another one of them. Oh, there are no hills here in Vietnam so far. But the bridge is there quite, quite big and steep. Good thing is bikes are free. So we're heading today, Tra Vin. Okay, back on nice quiet cycling roads here. Taking a ferry now, but that's closed down. So let's take the bridge instead. Oh, this into the 
last eight kilometers now. It should have only been a short day today, it was about 65, but two of the ferries we should have taken were not in use anymore, so to make a bit of a detour, so we'll be doing 78 kilometers today. Yeah, a bit more than expected. At least we found an alternative route over the bridges. music blasting out of many of the houses <laughs> that's karaoke <laughs> My music, that's karaoke. <laughs> Entering the town of Trabin, where we're staying this evening. Just, uh, I'll find a hotel now. Yeah. This is our hotel here. Okay, in the hotel, these are the Hotel, the other cycle tour group they use. So there's lots of other cyclists here who are just doing a Vietnam tour. But uh, it's a nice place, nice view. Yeah. Okay, that was the end of today. It was a nice day on the bikes again. Uh, across the Mekong River several times, some pretty big bridges, but uh, yeah, that was quite interesting. And, uh, now uh, tomorrow we're another day in the countryside, but not so many uh, river crossings tomorrow. We're just uh, mainly in the countryside, so it should be uh, also interesting to see all the <laughs> green vegetation that there, there is here. So yeah, how was today? I think we, tomorrow we have a longer day, I think about 86 kilometers tomorrow. Today should have been a short day, only 65, but we ended up doing 80 in the end. So, uh, because of the two ferry crossings that weren't operating anymore, so uh, yeah, so I'm a little bit tired, so I think we'll go to bed and have a rest. We have to get up early tomorrow. Okay, see you tomorrow.